Welcome back, everybody. Failure. That is too tough. Get out! Get out! Fall. Hold. Oh. <laughs> oh, there was a demon that didn't. No, 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 out of that! Out of that! Get back! Run! Got you! You can! There's nothing I can do. His magic was keeping her alive. I knew you would come. Cut the battle music! Oh my god! Don't move, Mother. We'll find a way to... Shh! Don't fret, darling. That man would have kept me trapped in here. Now, I'm free. I'll be with Carver and Bethany and your father. But you'll be all alone. I should have watched over you more closely. I should have... My little boy has become so strong. I love you. You've always made me so proud. Did you find her? I'm sorry, Uncle. She's gone. You were right about the flowers and everything. I... I can't believe she's gone. I let Bethany down. I promised her I'd look after Mother. So you're to blame. If you'd been quicker or stronger, you could have... She could be... <laughs> Why her? Why Leandra? Mother's gone. Will knowing why ease the pain? No, it won't. It will always seem senseless, won't it? Where's the one who did this to her? Did you find the person who killed Leandra? He's dead. It won't bring Leandra back, but I'll take comfort in knowing that. I should talk to the city guard, make arrangements to retrieve Leandra... Leandra's body. Take care, my boy.
I... I feel I should say something. I know you're not good at emotional stuff. At least your mother loved you. Not everyone can say that. I couldn't save her. I'm to blame. Listen, if you want to blame anyone, blame that madman, Quentin. You loved your mother and she knew it. It wasn't your fault. Greetings, Master. Your home was difficult to find. I've never been out on my own before, but I found it. Many people know of you. I hope I've made myself useful. I've already begun cleaning and I can cook. Not as good as Papa, but a little. Is there anything else you'd like me to do? If you're staying here, Arana, it will be as my servant. You mean... I won't be a slave anymore? You'll be paid, like anyone else. I... A slave is all I've ever been, like Papa and Grandpapa before me. I'll try to be a good servant. Thank you, Master. You're too good to me. Cleaning's been done, and your equipment... Boom! Ah, there he goes again. How he makes these things, I'll never know. Sandal's quite useful to have around. That he is. Also, I've always said... Oh, Maker knows what'll happen when I'm gone. I try not to think about it. I want some pie. I can make it for you, my lord. I'm so. No. Quest is there, huh? Wonder if they'll let me get a drink. I guess not. Welcome to the Hanged Man. Just passing through your fine establishment. <laughs> you haven't seen our little patrons yet. So he comes down wearing nothing but his boots. Yeah. Well, I guess we do figure this out. I'd be interested for Hawk right now as to what ties him to Kirkwall. Family is gone, everything is gone. <laughs> You know, a pirate's life wouldn't be bad. Ah, oh, you've returned. A new letter on your desk awaits your... Please come speak to me and only in me.
I don't know whether it was a bug or not. The only thing that really annoyed me about that scene... Oh, it's gonna be something, Toe, doesn't it? I, I just had to cut that battle music. The battle music kind of ruined it a little bit, but still, it was, uh, it was a lot better of a scene than, um, than Bethany's. It is apparently not enough that the Kunari define my political life. They must also infect what I hold personal. It is my son, Seamus. The life you saved, he would now squander by converting to the Kun. He has left for the Kunari compound. Please, Sarah Hawk, convince Seamus to come home. The Arishark says nothing good about Kirkwall, yet he accepts conversions. I cannot understand him. Maker knows I've tried, but he landed with, what, a few hundred men? Add up the deaths and defections, and the Arishok must need to bolster his ranks. I'm sure my son is quite the symbolic prize. He is of age. The decision seems rightly his. I want to let him find his way, but in my position... He's taken a great deal of inspiration from you. I want to allow his idealism, but not blindly. At best, my opponents will claim that my office is now in Kunari hands. At worst, I lose my son. Dragging your boy out of the compound won't help matters. I cannot leave him there. I hope you can convince the Arishot that this will only inflame the situation. He hasn't been quick to see reason to this point. It is a hope. I am still allowed that at least. Good day, Sir Arthur. Now I'm just... I don't know. Every tie that Hawk has is gone. Wait, why... How does the docks end up here? Where, oh, is this... Oh my god! Who else? You are not Yeah, I guess that was waylaid by... So was that anti Canari, anti-Viscount, or Seamus himself not wanting to be rescued? Seamus isn't the type. Let's go. Really curious to see where... <laughs> this has to lead to a big point. Uh, I, I can't imagine it not. I, as good as Hawk has done... Why stay? You are allowed, Basra, until the Arishok declares otherwise. The hell out of my face. So, hope the Arishok wasn't planning on keeping the Viscount's son. Sarah Hawk. I'm here about the Viscount's son. Are you? In four years, I have made no threat. And fanatics have lined up to hate us simply because we exist. But despite lies and fear, Ba still beg me to let them come to the Kuhn. They hunger for purpose. The son has made a choice. 
You will not deny him that. Also, uh, yeah, I'll cut off here. As always, thanks for watching. Tune in the next. Thanks for watching, folks.